folks, welcome back to the channel here. We are at Orange County, and uh, we're going to Indiana County Jimmy S, what it's called. That's what the uh, nine on here information is telling me on the uh, chart as well. Um, and it's in Pennsylvania. There's a little barbecue going on over there this morning, about kind of late morning. And uh, we have uh, Kevin, Kevin and his tiger, and then actually Pat and his Mooney uh, came over here from Morristown. Um, after he got out of the TFR over there, because uh, of President Trump's in town, and he's right in front of us, and we're going to go take go off, uh, get out of Orange County, to twenty three four five. Sounds good. Traffic. So we're going to fly over there to PA. It's about an hour and a half flight, so the cameras won't last that long. So I'm going to probably stop them uh, once we get up and do my thing, and then I'll put them back on. Uh, we'll see how it goes. But right now, let's check out the weather. One three zero niner Zulu, wind zero four zero at zero five, visibility one zero, sky condition clear, temperature two two Celsius, dew point one seven Celsius, altimeter three zero zero five, remarks. Okay, three zero zero five winds are favoring four. I'm going to go back over to standby over here. And I'm going to put the barometer barometer, and I'm going to do plus three zero zero. Zero zero five. Perfect. So that's in there. Orange County traffic. White says the Skyhawk turning left base runway four. Orange County. And we're gonna run up. Everybody's waiting here. We've got Kevin Pat and his team. And we'll see how. I'll pan out here. It's not going to be a formation flight, we'll just do our thing. Okay, checklist is complete. I did the walk around twice today. I cleaned the plane all up. And everything set, we put direct. Um, identifier is uh, India, Delta, India. A King, India, Delta, India. In King, India, Delta, India. <laughs> and we'll go to maps, and that's our map. Uh, there's some weather out there. County, White Cessna Skyhawk turning left base, runway four. There's a little weather Orange out there, County. but the clouds are high. Um, so we're going to see if it's going to skim us or not. So we'll play that by ear. We have an alternate. So it should be good. I don't have a camera on the outside of the airplane. So you ready, Chris? I'm set. Starting traffic, uh... Tiger 6 Tango Echo, we'll be departing runway 4 to the west. Anybody in the pattern? Orange County, automated advisory. Click your mic three times for an advisory, four times for radio check. So, uh, let's have a good flight out there. Okay, so there's, there's no one, cameras uh, on the outside one, because uh, I don't know how long uh, those batteries are going to last. Ready to go, you can probably get out before we I added some more inside. <laughs> Got all this cameras in here. We got a flight in three, so I'll wait for you. Orange County, Skyhawk on final for four, three miles. We're not going to do a... Uh, a Technically, a formation flight. We're going to fly out there together, show some of our support. Uh, so it should be a good turnout, hopefully. Orange County traffic two three November. Old we have uh, Kevin and his tiger the area to the northeast. In front, Orange we have uh, Pat uh, in okay, the middle, and his Mooney, and you have me. Which should be a good time here. So we're all in the green. Everything's warmed up good. I'm going to put the display on full. I got full synthetic, and I'm going to keep this. One for maps, and I don't try to get the wet. I won't get the weather yet. There's TFRs. Uh, the President Trump's in town. We're not going to be the, be close, even close to that. So direction of travel. The course heading is 271. So we're going to put 271 heading here. Wait to get the autopilot, and then we're going to put. We're going to go up. To, we're going to bug the. Altitude to uh, 45, I think, initially, and then we might go to 65. So put 45 first. Information on the airport. Indiana County. And then the weather over there. There's no weather over there, so I have to play that all by ear. Anyways, 5,500. They have 11 and 2,9. Two, two, 
three November Hotel, departing the area to the northeast. Last call, Orange County. Hey, we're gonna go back to full on the map. All my tapes right there. My engine monitoring is right there. He's on the runway. Doors are locked. Orange County traffic. Mooney six nine three. Mike Mike will be lining up on runway four, Orange County. I'm going to stop here. Okay, fuel pumps are to come on very soon. Uh, always okay, keep these two ready to go. A mixture is full rich now. Fuel pumps coming on. I'll take off with the mixture lean. You might ruin a cylinder. Traffic Mooney, 693 McMahon, departing runway 4, Orange County. And Orange County traffic Mooney, number uh, 2, lining up and waiting on uh, 4 for departing traffic. So we'll traffic. Pack, we'll pack it off the ground, we'll accelerate down. So we're all good, everything's in the green fuel pumps on, make sure for which props pull forward. Uh, we have flaps set at 15, now we have trim for takeoff. Pat's in the air, but a roll. And Orange County traffic, Mooney, 8th and we're rolling on 4. Okay, here we go. Right rudder. A lot of right rudder. Look at that P factor. Full throttle, 60. 65, 70, rotate. And get that gear up. We're over 80 miles an hour, but it shouldn't be too bad. Oh, not too bad. Looking good. And retract the flaps. Orange County traffic, Tiger clear of uh, Orange County traffic, uh, switching to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Uh, RNAV 0, 4, approach to a full stop. Kind of minor 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Orange County traffic, Moody is 6, 9 through McMahon, making a left cross with departure to the northwest, Orange County. Orange County traffic, uh, Mooney East number, uh, making a left crosswind. Uh, the partner pattern to the west. Orange County, see ya. And Mooney, did you take off on uh, zero 04? I did. All right, thanks. Here's on one, two, three, four, five. Mike, Mike. And uh, number three's on. Traffic, uh, stock uh, turning base for Orange County to do an engine out. I'm on a heading of uh, 271, uh, climbing to 4,500. Just got to be careful with uh, Allentown or Scranton's uh, airspace. I know, we're going to have to uh, either call them or uh, deviate a little bit to the uh, left. We're just to climb above it. You want to go to 65, then go to 65. Are we in agreement at 65? Yeah, let's go to 65. All right, going to 6,000 traffic. Uh, Blue Service uh, is uh, five miles Sal, straight Bucks, in. 6,500. Okay, let's pull, pull the power back. And pull the uh, RPMs back. Fuel pump's coming off, laying light's coming off. We're all on the green, looking good. We have uh, Tango Echo, six Tango Echo, right here. I don't know if you guys can see on that camera. We have uh, nine three Mike Mike, right here. I'm right there, and uh, we're gonna just follow, kind of follow each other, pay attention. We're not making an official formation flight. We're just gonna cruise out there together. And uh, Pat, I'm gonna come over to the right side in a couple minutes here. Copy. Orange County Blue Service, short final for runway four will be a full stop, Orange County. Orange County traffic stock, supported uh, four on the upwind, uh, we've remained in the pattern. Okay, 4,300, continuing up. Everything's in the green, we're looking good. 
Okay, good menu, go we'll go to the engine tools, let's go to lean a peak here, let's see what's going on here. So we're lean right now, with a pull back the mixture a little bit as we get up here. We're going to 6,500. So hit direct, enter, enter. Best, uh, second frequency is 122.75. 122.75, you want to go to? Affirmative. 122.75. One opposite, uh, Orange County traffic, the Blue Service is on left crosswind for runway 04. We're going to have to go back around the pattern. Yeah. Orange County. Copy that. And I'm here. Chris is here. I just do want to hear that guy. Just, uh, it's okay. It was just getting congested. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not sure if we could do 6.5. Maybe we have to climb up to 8.5. I'm not going to go through this in front of me with my uh, Aspen the way it is, so um, I'm going to deviate a little bit and we'll catch up. Yeah, I'm just thinking right now. Uh, why don't we just stay below it, get around it, and then we'll climb above it before we get to, uh, uh, what is it, Allentown? Uh, Scranton. Grant, we got a while ago. Uh, yeah, uh, that's exactly what I was thinking. So you want to uh, actually now just set down uh, below 4.5? Or 245? Uh, I'm at 65 now, so I'm just going to level off here. I'm right underneath it. Okay, so everybody's at 6,500. Affirmative. Okay. Just, we're just at the bottoms of it now. All right, 6,500. Level off. That we heard that reminder. All right, we're looking good. A little tri uh, trim, yeah, okay. Orange County looking uh, good. Service is one and a half miles out, turning from base to final, uh, Orange County. To our right, we got uh, Kevin out to our left. Let's see if I can get over towards uh, uh Pat's coming. Hey, Pat, I'm gonna be coming up on your left side. Uh, around, I'm at seven o'clock now. I got you in sight. I lost Kevin, he's over to our left here. He's at uh, 6,500 still. We're gonna go down to 4,500. Pat and I here, it looks like. Mike, Mike. What sexy bird is that? I see you. Three mile right base, three five summit. You're going 
going to four or five, right? Yeah. All right. All right, I'm going down to 45 as well. 10 4. I want Mike, Mike to uh, get annoyed. I ain't annoyed. That's the bottom line. <laughs> The traffic low, 5 o'clock, point two vertical miles. That's Pat to our right. So 4,000, we'll put the uh, altitude here, 4,500. This is a cool layer. Holy crap, this is cool. Quick, wow. All right, I'm at uh, 4,500. I got you. I'm about to like your 5 o'clock. Uh, we have a heading of what, 270? We're supposed to. All right, what's Scranton's um, frequency, guys? One moment. Should be 126.3. 26.3, thank you. All right, let's switch tanks. Um, let's see. There's no, unfortunately. Where did you go? Unfortunately, there's no airport in sight, but I have a highway right underneath me here. Was there something I said to you, Chris? I'm sorry to hear you. What's that, buddy? Where, where did you go? Like, you're just, like, so far away from me. Was there something I said? Oh, of course not. Please take a look, Roger. We'll clear through it. Um, uh,. About five o'clock to Kevin right now. Just trying to keep keep, keep it a little bit tighter. I don't want to bother you guys. I know you're starting to get busy again. All right. So let's switch tanks. Fuel pumps coming on. Zero two three six. Let's switch tanks. Leaving altitude. Okay. Whoop. That means I'm climbing. I got Kevin in front of me. Fuel pumps coming on. Coming six tango echo radar contact. Uh, about yeah, I'm five feet from the ground. Well, I do show two targets trailing behind you. You in the leading of formation. Um, yeah, they, they're going to contact you. Uh, we weren't sure we were close enough, but it is a flight of three. Uh, but like I said, they should be contacting you. Is it uh, three Grumman's? Negative, sir. It's uh, one Tiger, two Moonies. Six Tango Echo, Roger. If you're in contact with them on another radio, then you guys can proceed as a flight. I'll do that, sir. I'll tell them now. Hey, this is uh, Mooney, three Mike Mike with that flight. I was just about to check in with as well. Leaving altitude. And uh, the Mooney calling. You guys are so close together, it's a lot easier for me if you just continue as a flight. Copy that. Want the other two to uh, turn their transponders off or standby? Contact A18, turn right, heading 140, descend and maintain 4000. Okay, so we've got, Dave did all the talking for us, so we don't got to do anything. We're all looking good. So we have about another um, hour and 15 minutes to go. So, uh, we'll keep the cameras on a little bit longer. Make sure we don't miss anything. I'm following Kevin. I'm off course. Sir, by and this is the flight. Do you want two of our planes to uh, turn off the transponders? Do you have the two trailing aircraft? If you could squawk standby, please. Just squawk standby. Just squawk standby. Because they don't want the controller to have all these beeping sounds that there's traffic's close. So we'll put it on standby, which we did. All right, I'm on standby. So 23.6, 24. Looking good. Can lean it out a little bit more, but we'll keep it right there for now. Uh, we've got Kevin in front of us, and we have Pat somewhere behind me in my 5 o'clock-ish area. He's on the Dynon screen and also the uh, 540 from Abaddon here, IFD. And uh, three Mike Mike, and then we have six Tango Echo. So we're looking good. We got 16 gallons in the left. Two Bravo, good. 20 gallons in the right. Let's go to our display here. Um, let's go look at the map. Roger. That's our map. And this is the airspace we're talking about, right? Coming up right here. And then, of course, you have weather over here. I was talking to you guys about earlier. That's a TFR. We're not going to go in the TFR. Uh, President Trump's in New Jersey. Um, so we're going to just follow that line from Orange County. And it's just the weather that's going to, you know, might give us a little bit of issue on the way in. It seems to kind of, it seems to be going out kind of towards the east, not kind of out towards the northeast. So it's going like that. And I checked on the four flight and it said the same thing. 
So, so this red circle is a TFR uh, for President Trump, and then that's uh, Washington, D.C., obviously, it's a TFR, well, permanent, basically. Technically, a TFR is not MP a permanent, but that's going to be... That's going to be permanent, obviously, in D.C. there. Oh, keep a lookout in the weather. I can see it out to the left. Um, ceilings are high. It's just going to be making it a little wet. Uh, so we'll, we'll keep that in mind. So if you notice, I lost Pat on the uh, screen here because these are transponders on standby. Hey, Pat, you have me inside? I got you inside. Okay, just making sure I don't have you on the uh, screen here because we turn our transponders off to standby. Exactly. We're about two nautical miles off course. I'm just following Kevin. There's no set course here. Uh, we didn't have a flight plan in the system, so we're just kind of chilling up here. Beautiful morning. Winds are calm. We got about three, three knot-ish tailwinds. Um, it's so late, it's not even showing on here. We'll go back to full screen here. Display full screen. And if you like to get the six pack, um, just go back into menu, go to P, uh, PFD tools, and go to six pack, which is right here. Three D Manima, traffic about six southeast of Pocono, four thousand three hundred northwest bound, appears to be slowly climbing. That's your six pack. We're looking for that, sir. Slowly moving. Use the six pack uh, for about three flights, off and on. First flight, I had it on because I was so used to the six pack. Set of the tapes. And now I just use the tapes all the time. So there's your six pack. It's pretty cool, right? And go back to PFD tools, and then I'm going to take that off. You guys need a G meter. <laughs> I'm not pulling no G's today. That's for sure. But we have terrain on, we have um, airport flags on. We're just cruising along here. So we have 38 gallons remaining. We use six gallons now in a 40 minute time run. And a trip could be 48 minutes left, it should be. The time remaining for fuel is three hours and 40 minutes. All right guys, so I'm gonna save the batteries for landing. I'll get some, you know, some pictures in here with my other camera here. Uh, this way I don't have to change all the batteries out because um, we got half left. Two on the golf, readback is correct. Uh, and how soon before you're ready? So I'll see you guys in a bit when we get a little bit closer and fill you in. Uh, more ready. Right now we're over um, AVP, is the airport. Uh, that's who has us. I approach you, two minutes. Uh, flight the three. So that's all the updates I have right now. We have uh, three minutes. Call in two minutes for hour. Two minutes. To Let's see. Another hour. Uh, Miles south of your position, maneuvering. See you guys in a bit. Unknown. Guys, well, welcome back. Uh, we're just three quarters through this flight. Hey, Mike, can you hear me? We have some uh, clouds in the area. Yeah. We're obviously avoiding all the clouds at all costs, and we're going to. I can hear you, James. 
Alright, we're switching tanks, we're good there. Full pump coming off. We all look good. I think I'm gonna go upside down. Chris, they're copying you. I hear that. We're all looking really good here. Uh, we're okay, Tim. We are, are. We are uh, approximately 42 nautical miles out in uh, 18 minutes. Mike, can you hear me? Oh, it's perfectly clear over here. Got a nice little formation that's kind of for a few minutes there and got some good pictures. Put that out there for everybody to look at. Got Charlie and James on here. So we're all looking good. We have Kevin in front of us. We have Pat to our Guys, 38.9, right. 17 minutes out. Um, I don't know what runway we're using yet. Let me look at the weather again. So uh, we're going to use 1-1. Uh, one, one. Perfect. Uh, looks like left traffic. Seeing anybody? I'm just seeing uh, seven X-ray on there. Just uh, I guess he's climbing or descending. Now it's getting a little bumpy. It was smooth the whole trip. Now it's bumpy. Oh, what good. kind of traffic is this? Left or right? Left of traffic. What's up, Pat? What's up? So he has a little, see a little weather in the area over here. Uh, just not much is going on. Your wing. I see it, but. Left turn. Altitude 2500. Uh, AWOTS 126.625. Thank you. What a beautiful mountains over here, wow. CTAP is uh, 122.8. You already knew that, right? I already have a preset. Yep. Good. A little bumpy over here, Pat. Be careful. Ah. <laughs> okay, we're all looking good. We have the pattern altitude there is 25. So let's put the altitude at 25. Just a reminder that we're getting close to the pattern altitude. You guys have any ice filled up yet? <laughs> ice, ice, We got some cells in the area. 15 minutes out, guys. 13 uh, out. But we, I, you can, it's perfectly clear. I have definitely 10 uh, mile visibility straight ahead of me. And uh, we're they're broken around the... Uh, you'll see a very, very... Up, like, I don't know if the camera can see that or not. Uh, but that's a very thin layer of some haze. But it goes broken at 12,000. So we're good. We get a little wet, we get a little wet. Okay. Yeah, Kev, you can... You want to land first, you can. And then I'll be second. Pat will be third. Save the best for last. <laughs> of course. All right. All right. Looking good. Everything's in the green. We could eat the middle of an Oreo first and save the chocolate coating outside for last. See what I got to deal with, folks? Uh, I don't know. We're on the Talk Around channel. I right. got... Yeah, Chris, that'll work out great. I'll go one, you two, three. Fine. Okay, perfect. And uh, at runway 11, right? Check it out, the one's a 190, so uh, 190 is closer to 110 than it is to 29, right? Absolutely, we're good. Left traffic. Correct, and the pattern altitude is 2500, and if you want the uh, AWOS, uh, 126.6 and a quarter. I got all that, thank you sir, appreciate it. So, uh, KIDI, 10 minutes ago, FR, winds 190 at 6, uh, 10 uh, statue miles, we're clear, and uh, that's your uh, 3007 inches, it's already put in there already. Nothing down here. I see that. That's good, and we're going to use uh, one one. Let's monitor their channel. Uh, 
All right, we're looking sweet. Nice long uh, cross country for sure, for 200 miles. We banged it out pretty quick. Uh, Kevin's Tiger, fast Tiger. And uh, Pat and I had the Moonies, and we're doing really well. And six for Northeast, uh, Scott, Sky, or Cessna 57 Hotel Victor has departed uh, runway uh, 17. We'll be circling to the north. Good. I got this camera over here. Um, got that going. And we have everything inside. We have five cameras. One, two, three, four, five, six cameras inside. So you know what that means for me? The editing nightmare when you have all these cameras. So you got to match everything up. You got to. It's uh, just beautiful over there, gang. Uh, just, just with the poor flight showing, um, we're not going to have an issue at all. Yeah, I can definitely see way past 10 uh, miles in front of us. And a little thin layer on top of us and it's broken at 12,000. So we're good. Oh yeah, yeah, we're fine. All right, so we're gonna switch over to 22.8. That's the AWOS there. Jimmy Stewart Field, Tiger 6 Tango Echo 14 to the uh, east inbound landing. Runway 11, anybody in the pattern? Hey Pat, you still on? Okay, looking good, so we're going to start... Field from here, guys. Wow. Start slowing it down a little bit. Uh, Stay with traffic, uh, Palata 660 with the opposite. About uh, 50 miles uh, northeast of the field, inbound. Uh, setting up for runway 26 with Rod Saber. Any traffic in the pattern? Okay, so we have landing lights on. I have the positioning lights on, and I have the, uh, obviously, the anti-collision light. Positioning lights are on because it's a little hazy in some spots, so we'll keep that on. Landing lights on. Uh, mixture not full rich quite yet. I'm going to slow down. we got to slow down the, the, the Tiger <laughs> chance to get into pattern. And Zoom in a little bit. Got my targets on there. Mike turned his transponder off, so he's on, so he's over there. I got Ke uh, uh, Kevin in front of me. In Indiana traffic, Mooney number two, the green Mooney, is uh, seven miles out to the east. If we can find it, following the Tiger in for 1 1. Indiana Tiger 6 Tango Echo 5 to the uh, east inbound landing, runway 1 1. Setting up for a left down one. Approaching uh, altitude. Echo is on a left downwind, coming up, uh, approach into 2-9. Okay, in India traffic, Green Mooney is on a 3 mile 45 midfield, left downwind for 1-1, one -one. behind the Tiger, we're number 2, India. He's on a left downwind, the beam the number is 2-9. Okay, so let's get that display back full. Airport's in sight. So gas is on. Undercarriage very soon. Indiana traffic. Mike is entering uh, the left downwind for only one point. And we'll do Indiana. one flaps, two flaps. Slow us down. Indiana traffic, uh, Moon Indy number two is uh, downwind now for 1-1, one, one, final tiger, and we're number two to land, Indiana. Yeah, traffic system for each or something, thanks for it, just reported 1-1, one, one. we'll be in the pattern, touch you guys, Indiana. Indiana traffic, Falcon 7, three golf hotels about uh, seven miles to the east, inbound, be uh, landing runway 1-1, one, one, and uh, we'll be entering a left downwind for 1-1. One, one. I'm trying to slow it down a little more. Uh, yes, sir, I did. Wow. Okay, looking good. We're all good. Man, have you never seen a Falcon before? Gas, undercarriage, mixture. Uh, more than happy to get out of his way if he wants me to. No problem with that. 
And a traffic tiger turning uh, left base. One more. Slow down a little more. Let's go full flaps now. Let's get situated. We're beating 11 numbers. Indiana traffic, 7-3 Golf Hotel. We're just descending through about 6400 now, about uh, 5 east. We'll go to a wide left that one until we get you guys in sight. You got three of us coming in, traffic. one on base and two on downwind. Okay, we'll keep it a little bit wide until we get you guys in sight, and we'll uh, give you a call when we enter downwind. Do that. Yeah, traffic system for you. So next ray is left crosswind for 1-1 Indiana. Touch you go. Indiana traffic, uh, Green Mooney is extending my downwind uh, for landing traffic, uh, number two, Indiana. Whiskey Alpha is uh, four mile final, two six, Rock Saber. And Indiana traffic, Mooney, uh, Mooney six nine through McMahon Exhaust is going to be extending the downwind, Indiana traffic. Indiana traffic, 191 Tango, Lima, 10 miles to the uh, northwest. The gas, undercarriage, mixture, prop speeds. We got the gas on the fullest. Indiana traffic, uh, Green Mooney is turning left base for 1 1, number 2 to land behind the Tiger. Indiana. Indiana traffic, just a 4807 X ray. We're, uh, we're left downwind for 1 1, Indiana. Indiana Moving traffic, altitude. 7 3 Golf Hotels, on a left crosswind uh, for 1 1. Have a, looks like a Cessna in sight midfield. Is that the third aircraft? I think that's, uh, I think we're number three here. Okay, thanks. We're going to be a little bit wider than you, and we're descending to pattern altitude now, 7 3 Golf Hotel. Indiana traffic moves on a two mile final for 1 1. Indiana. Indiana traffic, Moody 6 9 through Mike Mike. It's on the, the left base for runway 1 1, Indiana traffic. Okay, looking good. So, gas, undercarriage, mixture, prop is good. We got full flaps. We'll watch our speed. Seatbelts are on. Long runway. Approaching minimums. In Indiana traffic, Moody short final. 1 1, full stop, Indiana. Minimums. I have no idea where to go. Full straight ahead into the ramp, then we'll figure it out. Yeah, traffic just a forty jersey. Right, check that gear is down a lot. Green light is on. For one one, Indiana. A little windy, a little cross. Indiana traffic seven three golf hotels on a left uh, downwind, just getting ready to turn left base. Indiana one one. Yeah, traffic Moody, 693, but Mike is on final for runway 11, Indiana. Let's roll it out. Indiana traffic, system 4 is your 7 x ray turning final 11. Uh, we'll be a touch and go, Indiana. And it's up to turn in final 11, Indiana. How far up the end of the runway are you? We're about half a mile. Okay, we made it. Looking yeah, good. We're in Indiana, here, we'll Pennsylvania. Oh, no problem. For We're barbecue. About, uh, we'll be about a three mile final when we turn at 7 3 Golf Hotel. Hey, booty clear. Um, we are going to do some video on the ground here and have a little fun. So, folks, thanks for flying along. I really appreciate it. Like what I'm doing, consider subscribing to my channel. On left base one um, one. Find me on Facebook Indiana. and yeah, Instagram. Uh, 3,600 feet. This is pretty cool. Finally, had that maybe I don't know months now. I guess maybe. So until next time, folks. Fly you. safe. Be safe. I'll see ya.
Aviation is not just a hobby for me. It's a dream I always thought of as a child. And today, I'm living that dream with friends of aviation across the United States. Remember, always have that goal in the back of your mind, no matter what it is. And always try to achieve your dream. Because one day, you never know, your dream just may come true. Like mine did, by working hard with multiple jobs, friends helping me become a pilot. A pilot was a dream of mine since I was a kid. And here I am, living it, and flying around the United States with friends that I never would have met if I didn't become a pilot and live my dream. Until next time, folks, fly safe, be safe. I'll see you guys next time. Thank you.